Welcome, 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 beautiful Paris Saint-Germain family. It's your boy PS Gent. We have some breaking news regarding Xavi Simons because this recently came out from Fabrizio Romano as an exclusive. Exclusive. Xavi Simons has formally informed Paris Saint-Germain by his plan to leave the club this summer. Key detail. It will be a long move until June 2025, as mentioned since April. Bayern and Leipzig both pushing to sign Xavi Simons' decision after the Euro. So we were obviously waiting for this after the Euros. Xavi Simons said, you know about my future after after the Euros, but what it looks like is Xavi Simons was indicating towards which future club he will go out on loan instead of is he going to go leave Paris Saint-Germain or no and I mean I feel devastated because I've been rooting for this guy I've been watching him at PSV I've been watching him at Leipzig I've been propping him and everything and this is how he pays me and a lot of PSG fans who have been following him back it's it's cool yeah, it's disgusting. It's filthy. It's filthy. Uh, it's a weak mentality. It's a very weak mentality. Guaranteed playing time. This is Paris Saint-Germain. Like, why did you come back to this club if you... Because the thing Travis Simons has to understand now is there ain't going to be another chance at PSG. He's not going to be loaned out and then can make a decision. No. We're selling him 100% after. I mean, either it would be like a loan with an obligation to buy as been reported with Bayern or we sell him completely. Because, yeah, this mentality does not suit this club. But still, I would, I would still say somewhat thank you, Chavez Simons, because he will actually be leaving this club, giving us, I don't know, at least 90 million euros. Unlike a certain rat. Uh, but yeah, that's it. I feel a bit devastated. I had some hope. I had some hope. Uh, yeah, doesn't look to be so. And, you know, Luis Enrique, the stuff he's been saying, uh, at least been reported that he, he's pushing to get him back, just shows that, yeah, Xavi Simons is a, is a filthy, I mean, he just has an extremely weak mentality because the manager himself is telling him, you will have a big chance at Paris Saint-Germain. I like your versatility. We'll play at least 80 games next season. You will get enough game time. And that's still not enough for Xavi Simons, that the manager of the club is pushing to get you back, but you're still thinking about some trauma that Pochettino and Leonardo gave you. Absolutely disgraceful. And I would not be rooting for him again now that he will go on loan. Especially if it's buying. Like, when I try to think about big clubs loaning out a big player, I can think of like Courtois from Chelsea to Atletico Madrid. I, I don't remember. I, don't, I, I can't think of any more. But yeah, we, I mean, we're strengthening a European rival here with this loan. Um, I wish we could have sell, sold him now. That would have been much easier for everyone. Xavi can find his new club. PSG can get his money. And the new club will have him permanently. I think that would suit everyone. Uh, I think the last thing that PSG cannot do is put in an, uh, an option to buy or something because Xavi Simons might have another incredible season and his value might go up to even 120, 130. So it should be a dry loan, no option, no obligation, none of that. And as reported by Jamil, the potential price will not be 60 to 70 million as Platicol has been reported. It will be around the 100 million region. But once again, that's go for next summer. That's been it from the Fabrizio Romano exclusive. Chambi Simons will go out and loan for the next 2024-2025 season. That's been it from your boy PSG. And as usual, Ade Ade. Ade Paris.